Greetings everyone, this is Sherman Brown and welcome to week 89 of Aim High Insights. You know, ever so often when I go and speak at a school, sometimes the administrators would ask me to speak to their school teams. So it might be a debate team or it might be some other team that's going for a scholastic competition. And I would always listen out for the end results after giving them some advice and some, you know, some coaching. Some would come back very excited because they won and they were victorious. And obviously they would be excited because of that. But what I find funny is those who come back and who didn't win. And they would come back and they would say, look, Mr. Brown, you know, we tried our best, you know, but we lost. But here's the good thing. As long as we gave it our best, that's all that really matters. And I would say to them at that time, look, I'll be honest with you. I don't really believe in moral victories. I don't believe in the, well, I gave it my best and that's all that matters. Here's the fact you lost. And the reason you lost is because you gave it your best. And when I say that, they will be confused and dumbfounded. What are you talking about? Here's the fact. Those who win, they don't win because they give it their best. They win because they give it their all. And there's a complete difference between those two things. You see, too many of us walk through life just trying to give it our best. And here's what we need to understand. Your current best has given you what you currently have. Your current best has made you who you currently are. So if you want to rise and go up higher to another level, it's not about giving it your best. It's about giving it your all. But the problem is too many of us are not doing what Les Brown said, to live full and die empty. Many of us are working towards our goals, but we're tippy-toeing around this thing. We're bouncing around it. We're living halfway. If you want to take it to the next level in your life, you're going to have to start to give it your all. You say you really want it, but how bad do you want it? You have to give it your all, leaving all on the line. You see, when I go and I speak at these colleges, look, I don't care how much they try to pay me. They can never pay me for what I do. And this is the reason why. Because the amount and the heart that I put into my craft cannot be measured by a price tag. You have to give it your all, leave your all on the line, and that's the only way that you're truly going to win it in life. So as you're thinking about your goals and the things that you're doing, let me ask you a question. Are you giving it your best or are you giving it your all? And if you give it your all and you don't win, this is the reason why it wasn't your timing yet. Because I truly believe in God's divine timing and he knows when things are supposed to come to you. So if you're giving it your all, continue to give more. Live full, die empty. This is Sherman Brown reminding you to keep your ambition, inspiration, and motivation high.